Rob. I am in long-term recovery from opioid addiction for the past eight years. So my journey with opioid addiction started at 25 years of age, and I got clean and sober at 32 years of age. In my act of addiction, I lost everything. I got divorced, uh, I lost custody of my children, I lost all you know, relationships and contact with my family. Um, in recovery, I gained so much more back. My general mood improved. Um, I was happy more. I started smiling. You know, I always tell people that in recovery, you know, I got my smile back. My physical health got better. Um, so many things in my life improved once I found recovery. And it happened quick. Um, I started having fun and enjoying life. And I think, you know, that's a misconception about recovery is that, you know, once once we get clean, once we get sober, that we don't have fun anymore. And my life is, is very fun. I enjoy my life today. I have fulfillment. Active addiction is complete chaos. And today I have the exact opposite of that. I have serenity. And, you know, that's something I'm extremely grateful for. And a lot of people, believe it or not, are like, you know, they're afraid to go to treatment or, you know, um, recovery meetings of any kind because they're afraid to run into people that they know. Um, and I'm saying, well, they're there for the same reason you are there. Stigma prevents people from seeking help, you know. Stigma can prevent somebody from putting their hand out and saying, I need help because they are ashamed. You know, I think collectively, if society um, and the community start, you know, addressing addiction, a substance use disorder, um, as a health issue, as a health crisis, you know, I think collectively we can shift that thinking, that negative connotation. There's very little, you know, positive uh, therapeutic value in having stigma attached to addiction. The one piece of advice I give to, to somebody struggling with addiction is, you know, give recovery a chance. What do you have to lose? I mean, we've already given up so much with addiction. Um, give it a real chance. Give it a full chance. You know, accept the help. There's, there's so many, you know, avenues and pathways to recovery. And there's so many people who want to help. So, you know, if I could give my, you know, my active addiction self just one piece of advice would be to, to really try recovery, to put your hand out and ask for help because the help's there.